Harvard University has recently made a significant leap in quantum computing technology, spearheaded by Mikhail Lukin. The team has developed a quantum processor that is capable of handling 48 logical qubits. This innovation is a key step towards creating large-scale, error-resistant quantum computers. Quantum computing operates on the principle of quantum bits, or qubits, which are analogous to the binary bits in traditional computing. Despite over two decades of research demonstrating the feasibility of quantum computing by manipulating quantum particles such as atoms, ions, or photons. The challenge has been to harness quantum mechanics for practical computation. This involves overcoming the inherent instability of physical qubits. The breakthrough in quantum computing hinges on the creation of logical qubits. These are essentially clusters of physical qubits that have been error corrected and are capable of storing information for quantum algorithms. The creation of stable and controllable logical qubits has been a major hurdle in the field. Until now, the most advanced systems could only demonstrate a couple of logical qubits and a single quantum gate operation between between them, Mikhail Lukin's team at Harvard, in collaboration with Marcus Greiner, MIT colleagues, and Quera Computing, has made a landmark achievement by developing a programmable, logical quantum processor. This processor can encode up to 48 logical qubits and perform hundreds of logical gate operations, marking the first instance of executing large-scale algorithms on an error-corrected quantum computer. This development signals the beginning of fault-tolerant quantum computing. The work, published in Nature, involved a neutral atom array quantum computing architecture using ultra-cold rubidium atoms. These atoms, serving as physical qubits, can be entangled to form computing gates. The team's success in creating low error rates in these operations underscores the reliability of their system. Denise Caldwell of the National Science Foundation, which funded the research, praised this achievement as a significant advancement in quantum information processing. The logical quantum processor developed by Harvard allows for the parallel multiplex control of logical qubits, a more efficient and scalable approach than managing individual physical qubits. Let author Dola Blivstein, a PhD student in Lucan's lab, emphasize the goal of transitioning from testing algorithms with physical qubits to using error-corrected ones. The team aims to expand the types of operations on the 48 logical qubits and to achieve continuous operation of the system. This research, supported by DARPA, the NSF, the Army Research Office, and Quera Computing is a vital step in the journey towards practical and large-scale quantum computing with wide-ranging implications for science and technology.